Pally Survivor did a very good video I watched earlier about um, different types of lighters and which are best. And um, because of that video, I think I'm going to have to buy myself some clipper lighters. But um, I thought it would be worth showing off this little thing I got off Amazon a while ago because it was very cheap and it's actually surprisingly good. And a lot of the flaws he was saying about in some of the lighters he had don't seem to be that uh, prevalent in this lighter. So it is a Coney, I think it's called, uh, jet lighter. And uh, it was about just under £5 on Amazon and it's filled with butane gas. And the nice thing is it's refillable and um, the gas is very cheap to refill. So you might be able to hear it's starting to rain now and um, we will actually test how well then it can light wet things. Now an interesting thing of this is it has a very easy to adjust gas uh, system for it. So if we take the cap off, uh, there is a little bit you can twist here that affects the uh, amount of gas that goes into the lighter. So when set to minimum burst, you get that much. And when set to maximum burst, you get that much. And what's very nice this lighter that surprised me is the amount of butane that's used is very low. Especially if you just sort of burst it because it's very hot. So if you can see where the liquid level is in about there or the gas level, that is just under the bit where it would be full. Uh, it only goes up to where that little nozzle first goes in. And it's been a while since I've refilled it. I never ran it completely dry uh, when I used it for over half an hour of you know stuff not in one go it um, only went to about two thirds full so it's actually very economical on um, lighter gas it has an electric element inside which lights it when you uh, strike it so it's very easy to use and it seems to last a while so let's test it out and see how well it can set stuff on fire now hopefully you should be able to see it's quite wet uh, these leaves are damp, which I'm going to try and burn first. So we'll see if it can light damp leaves. Now I'm going to start off on the lowest jet setting, then if it won't light, I'll try it on the highest jet setting. So, first test, wet leaves. It starts from singeing uh, on the lowest setting, so we'll try the higher setting. You see that gets enough of a spark going to actually start it burning on there, so um, works alright even on wet leaves. Obviously if these were dry leaves they'd have gone up much faster than that, so works fine on wet leaves. Next we'll try damp newspaper. I'll start this off on the highest setting just so it's a bit faster. See that's starting to singe on there. and that light newspaper up fine even when it's damp. Now we've got a relatively dry bit of tissue. That lights up no problem. Now this isn't going to be a great example of this, but what you should hopefully be able to see is that barely any of the liquid has been used up inside it. It's pretty much at the same position it started off in. So it's very economical on the butane use, and it's a very handy little nifty lighter. Um, there's probably much better models than this around, but for the five quid or so it cost, really can't fault it. I'll link in the video description to the Amazon page where I got it.